wave is so good. I, that's mainly what it is, is just how good the wave is. And yeah, it's just home. Um, so my name's Ivy, I'm 19 and I'm from Coolangatta on the east coast of Australia. Um, originally from Brisbane but lived there till I was about one and then moved to Cooley and didn't really look back. Um, I'm just here with my family, my mom, my dad and my little brother and sister and I've been in this same house for 18 years so I'm pretty lucky like just a short walk to get to Snapper and Kira and yeah, I'm very lucky. I've grown up with one of the best ways in the world at my doorstep, so it's pretty cool. I think I just really like how because I've lived here for so long, how familiar it is. And just seeing like all your friends out every day because you know everyone, all the locals, all the old boys that are out there every day is really awesome. Um, just because there's been such a big surf culture here for a while, like a really long time, it's just really cool and the wave is so good. You can get some of the longest waves ever, your legs are burning by the end of it and it's so awesome. And Sometimes it's really fast and sucky and hollow and other times it'll be a bit slower and I think because the sand's always changing and they're always pumping sand out of the river mouth there, it kind of keeps it all different. I mean, I know lots of like reef breaks, the waves normally generally the same or rocky bottom or whatever, but with the sand point, it's just, it's always changing, always keeping you on your toes, which is really cool. You never really know what you're gonna get. So when you get a good day, it's so good. You just surf it every day, no matter what it's like and then when you get it good, it's, it makes it even better. I mean, when I started off surfing, um, I was probably 12 and riding a high performance shortboard because I figured it's snapper and that's just what you do. So as soon as I started on longboards, I realized how different it was and how the shortboarding community doesn't really take longboarding as seriously and everyone would drop in on you or whatever, but it's kind of more the more time I surf out there, the, the more that the locals know that I live here as well. It gets a lot easier. It's definitely hard with the crowd, but the wave's so good, it's so worth it when you get one, for sure. But at the moment, I'm just so obsessed with my longboard. It's a it's a 9-2 um, Mitch Sermon shape. He's from the Sunshine Coast. And it's just the most fun board I've ever had. And I love surfing it every day. And it's just figuring out what it's good in and what doesn't work. And yeah, mainly the longboard, especially because Snapper through to Green Mount is such a good way for longboarding. It's, it's really underrated in the longboarding world. I think everyone thinks of Byron and of Noosa, but they never think of Cooley as a longboarding spot. So yeah, that's that's really about it. Just a 9-2 single fin. That's what I love the most. <laughs> Makes me the happiest. <laughs>